Hello, welcome to my channel. Today we are making a nice, rich, eggless chocolate cake just in time for Diwali. I'm going to start off by baking the cake and my ingredients for the cake are I have here three cups of self-raising flour which I served 125 gram of salted butter but if you're not using salted butter you can add 5 ml salt and one third of cocoa powder one cup of brown sugar 5 ml of bicarbonate soda 10 ml of vanilla essence 15 ml of vinegar 2 cups of water Firstly, I'm going to melt out my butter I've melted my butter and I'm adding it to my dish To the melted butter, I'm going to add in my vanilla essence which is 10 ml thereafter I'm adding in my 15 ml of vinegar and now my two cups of water I will give this a nice mix Here yeah, I have my three cups of flour of which I served and now I'm going to work with my dry ingredients To my flour I'm going to add in my sugar my one third of a cup of cocoa powder and 5 ml of bicarbonate of soda I will give all the dry ingredients a good mix I'm adding my dry ingredients to the wet I will mix this all together Here's my mixed batter I'm using a burnt baking pan which I greased very well with some margarine and I'm going to pour the batter into to this point I'm going to use my hand to get the last bit of the batter into I'm just using my spoon to even my batter out I started preheating my oven about 30 minutes ago to 175 and I'm gonna put this batter into the oven to bake for 60 minutes I give it a nice shake before putting it into the oven okay so now this is ready to be popped into the oven forty five minutes has passed and we checked on our cake in the oven and it's done but I did estimate for sixty minutes but depend on your oven so I'm ready to take my cake out of the oven
Here you go. The cake has rose very well. Don't worry about these cracks because we are going to turn the cake over. Now I'll allow this cake to rest and cool down a little while I make the chocolate drizzle icing for the cake. My ingredients for my chocolate icing drizzle, I have 60 gram of butter, 30 ml milk, 2 ml vanilla essence, and 20 ml cocoa powder, one and a half cup icing sugar. Firstly, I'm going to put the stove on very low because we don't want our butter to burn. I'll add my butter to the pot. And let this melt away slowly. I am working on a very low heat and my butter has melted. So I'm adding in my 30 ml milk to it. Now this is just beginning to bubble. So I'm going to switch off the stove. To this, adding my 2 ml vanilla essence and my 20 ml cocoa powder. My one and a half cup icing sugar. I'm ready to turn over my cake to my cake stand. Oh, beautiful. Now I'm ready to pour my drizzle over. Here's my cake with the chocolate drizzle on it. It's looking so delicious. And you don't have to be too neat while doing that. If you feel you like a weaker drizzle, you can add a little bit milk. Now to make it a little extra good, I found a piece of chocolate in the fridge. So I just grate it over. Now we are ready to serve our chocolate cake. Now I'm ready to cut a slice Here you can see, it's done truly. There you go, your slice of eggless chocolate oven. This is a very perfect treat for Diwali. And it goes very well with a nice cup of tea. I know Pranesh is gonna enjoy. Don't forget to check our recipes that we made last year for Diwali and the recipes that Hazel helped us with. And I hope your preparation for Diwali is going great. 
may we all be blessed on this auspicious time. Thank you all for watching and enjoy.